In the audio montage window, you assemble audio clips into a montage. You can arrange, edit and playback clips on an unlimited number of tracks. Features include track and clip based effects, volume and pan automation and wide ranging fade and crossfade functions. You can use the audio montage window for creating music CDs, stem mastering, multimedia work, radio spot production and even work on sound for motion picture using the video playback capabilities. You can create multi-track compositions and author professional audio CDs or DVD audio, or render your work for streaming and distribution. You can place any number of clips on an audio track. A clip contains a reference to a source audio file on your hard disk, as well as start and end positions in the file. When you delete or change a part of a clip, the audio is not deleted or permanently changed. Instead, a set of pointers keeps track of all the edits so that these can be readily reversed. You can use multiple tracks to structure your audio montage visually or logically. In the case of stem mastering, you might want to use one track per stem. The audio montage features a special type of track called the reference track, where you can place a reference audio file and AB seamlessly with ease. The tabs in the audio montage window give you access to the tools and options you need for editing audio montages. View to precisely navigate and zoom around your montage. Change colors and store and recall view snapshots. Edit for common editing tasks such as selecting and cutting. Insert for placing markers or inserting or replacing audio files or inserting a video file. The Process tab allows for normalizing the loudness of clips in relation to each other and time and pitch changes. You can use Auto Split to divide clips into several using various parameters and combine clips into a submontage by creating a superclip. The Fade and Envelope tabs are where you find the tools to create and alter fades and tweak volume and pan envelopes to perfection. Use the Analyze tab to decide on the monitoring input for your meters. You will use Render to render your finished audio montage using several options and in one or multiple formats. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please feel free to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.